for to bond. Uh -huh. Now Rebecca gave birth to Mary. Uh -huh. And the name Mary means sea of bitterness. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. But then see, Mary, Mary gave birth to Renee. Uh -huh. And what the devil didn't know uh -huh. is that the name Renee means to be reborn or to be renewed. Uh -huh. Come on. Happy birthday to me. Hey. Hey, babe. You getting ready to head out? Yeah, yeah. It's about that time. All right. <laughs> I love you. Mm -hmm. I love you too. Have a good day. You too. Bye bye. It ran in her family until it ran into her. Looks like you already got your butt handed to you this week. I'll catch you later. You been taking your vitamins? Good. It's a new outfit in there on the bed for you. Put it on after you put some soap on it. You're having company tonight. Turn that shit off. You having company. You having company tonight. 
The rules are simple. Use it. You know the rules. Use it. The rules are simple. The rules are simple. Use it. You got, you got one hour. No bruises. Hurry up! You're having seven tonight. Dope. I gotta go. What? 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 Alright. Who was that? He don't look like money. He's just a friend. Mm-hmm. Follow the instructions on the box and leave a stick on the sink. your motherfucking face. <laughs> now I got to go figure this shit out. I need another mouth to feed like I need a hole in my motherfucking head. <laughs> Shut up! Every day, like a birth control pill. What did you say? Did you say something about a birth control pill? Well, you sure don't need none. Cause you wear yours on your face, ugly dog. I'll see you later. Yep. Good guys. Yep. I thought pigeons traveled in packs. Hey, what's up? I haven't seen you in a minute. You okay? I've... I've been sick. Oh. You alright? No. I'm pregnant. Pregnant? Wow. Okay. I got you. <laughs> Is this long dick dairy? Is this cootie cat cow?
this pipe with a plumber. This Rebecca James, bitch. The rules were simple. And you didn't fucking follow them. Somebody gonna pay for this motherfucker to die. I know it was you. I tested six already. And you must be the baby daddy. I ain't the daddy. Somebody gonna pay for this motherfucker to die. I don't want no problems. Problems? Why you calling me? You gonna pay. The baby ain't my goddamn baby. Don't call my goddamn house about that no more. Shit, I ain't got no goddamn leaky pipe. You better call somebody else. Don't call my goddamn number no more. Motherfucker just hang up on me. Shit. Call your punk ass back. Don't call my house no goddamn more. I ain't the daddy. Somebody gonna pay for this shit. I ain't got no leaky pipes. I shot my shit on the comforter. God damn it. I told you. If you can't feed the baby, then don't have a baby. I ain't had no goddamn baby. You got the wrong goddamn guy. Shit. I got my damn tubes tied.
years old. Arrest him! No! <laughs> Let me go! Let me go! I am as cool as the world! You like playing with dolls? Yes. <laughs> I do too. <sighs> Damn, nigga. She just six. You can't wait till she 13? Some more dolls like that? You just asked for Uncle Demarcus. Demarcus, what the fuck is taking so long? The clock don't. Renee, come to mommy. Come to mommy right now. Calm 
down, bitch. Here, take another hit. Are you Miss James? It depends on who the fuck wanna know. Oh, yes, yes, of course. Uh, my name is Judith Orion. I'm from Child Protective Services, and we received an anonymous call about a child that lives on this premises. <sighs> Mommy, are you mad at me? No, baby, not at all. Are you okay? Yeah. <sighs> I got you, okay? You're gonna be okay, okay? Just stay in here with me, okay? We're gonna be okay, okay? Just play with your dog, play with your dog, okay? Sit back here, play with your dog. Mommy gotta make herself, okay? Okay? <laughs> okay, play with your dog, play with your dog. Okay. Okay. Okay, your hair's so pretty. An anonymous call. Mm. Yes, and this is just a routine check, Miss James. No need to be alarmed. I'm here because CPS take all calls we receive about a child in danger very seriously. Oh, yeah. <laughs> While you sleep, <laughs> we gonna play. Yeah. <sighs> Don't fight this, come on. No. Yeah. Yeah. Don't fight it. Yeah. No. Come on. Don't fight this. Come on. No. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. No. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, do you mind if I take a look around the home and speak with the child? Yes, the fuck I do mind. And just FYI, I'm not alarmed at all. The only motherfucker in present danger on these premises is your little yellow narrow ass if you don't get the fuck up out of my yard. Miss James, this will only take a few... Ah! Get the fuck out of my yard. Get the stick. I got this copper pipe and cash. Get the fuck up out of my yard. Ain't nothing here but this old pussy. Okay. 
fuck you and this raggedy ass, y'all. Native American princess that Disney made a movie of. I want to be a princess too. But you are a princess. You're a beautiful princess. No, we can make our own movie. <laughs> but first, we need to get you in the bath and in the bed before your mama get home. So come on. Enough pizza. You first. All right. Meet you upstairs. Go ahead. Yeah. I got you. <laughs> you had a step in party. Oh, a step in party. Yes, you are. Step in is just a classy ass. And we'll take you to a place that you've never been. A step in party. Talking a step in party. Step in is just a classy ass. Yeah. And we'll Come on, help me make a way. In the streets, everybody's saying to do the way that this is where it's going down. Yeah. The water's getting cold. That means it's time to get out. Can I have the towel now? Mm -mm. Come, on. Come on, I'll dry you off in the room. Okay. All right. You won't need a towel, baby. I'm going to use my tongue. You know what? Every time I try to go out and have some fun with my friends, you pull up with that bullshit. You know what? Oh. You need to hit this. Look, you need to lose I it sell up. this shit. I don't use it. All right? Okay. So bring your ass on.
So, you going out tonight? No. Good morning. My man coming through. So we just gonna kick it here again tonight. Damn! You know I live here too, right? Bye, Gil. And I told you I don't have a problem watching Renee. Why y'all can't just go and kick it at his place? You know what? I don't think it's cool that you have these niggas around your little girl. So now you concerned. Always been. This is my motherfucking house. I can have any and everybody. I, I really don't give a fuck what you think. Matter of fact, what I do think is that it's time for you to get the fuck out. Really. Get the fuck out. The fuck you? You can get the fuck out. Girl, Tell me who I'm supposed to have around my motherfucking kid. Fuck you. You don't have to get. Fuck you. Oh no. <laughs> and she, and she slammed it. Oh, she wanna slam some fucking shit? Really? Look at this. And I thought you don't use it. Get the fuck out of here. This is been. I can't take this. Everybody got to fucking go. And she slamming those like she paid bills in here. What? See this right here? Some motherfucking bullshit. Nah, hold on a second. Open this goddamn door. Really? Do I got a daughter or do I got a son? Cause you got big fucking balls slamming doors in my house. <sighs> Listen, I'm about to go to the welfare office to get my stamps. And you know that take all day. That should give you enough time to clean up. And you can start by clean. Clean this go goddamn room. Unproductive mother. Oh, I can't. Oh, I'm so sick of motherfucker. Oh. Bye. Watch out for the cops, bodies drop, be careful of getting popped.
west to east, we in the belly of the beast. It ain't no peace, not even for the police. The pace of the race, no haste, it's like a chase. This crazy place got to catch you. Listen, since you ran my man off, I'm not gonna keep a roof over your head or pay the bills no more. It's time for you to take care of me or hit the goddamn door. <laughs> If I see you with another razor blade, cutting on yourself, talking about easing the pain, I'm gonna beat you till you're black and blue. Try me and see if I'm playing. <laughs> so, you gotta stop cutting on yourself so your body can be presentable. Ain't nobody gonna ever buy your ass, but at least you still rentable. <laughs> Happy motherfucking birthday to you, huh?
Where the fuck you think you going? It's my birthday. I'm 18. So you gonna leave? So you gonna leave me? Everything I've been through since the day you were born. And you gonna pack your little shit and leave me? <laughs> what you think somebody gonna love you? Hmm? My little precious Renee, we don't know what love is. What you think somebody gonna marry you? Hmm? Big house, white picket fence or some shit? <laughs> you ain't nothing but a used up hoe. I should have named you Alice. Cause you living in Wonderland if you think somebody gonna love you. The fuck out my face. Pack your little shit in that one bag. Motherfucking 18 years old and that's his, that's all your shit in one bag. <laughs> Get the fuck, you made me a fuck on my toe. Get, look at this. Yeah, okay. What the fuck, you ain't got a pot to piss in when the, girl, bye. Fucking messed up my toe. Get the fuck, I'm pack up and leave. Go, go. Happy birthday. It's not fatal. Take that antibiotic as prescribed. You should be clean in a few days. You do understand that no matter what method you use, birth control does not prevent disease. I know that doc. Look, since I don't plan on ever having kids, can I just make an appointment and you know, you cut my tubes Hell, just take the whole uterus out. Absolutely not. First of all, by the law of nature, you're just too young. But come and see me after you're over the age of 35 and if you're still strung out on this idea that motherhood just isn't for you, I'll consider it. But until then, here's a list of birth control methods that you can use. We've got the pill, the diaphragm, the cervical cap, the sponge, the spermicide, the patch, and the shot. All of those things work from the inside. Okay, then we have the implant, the IUD, and then you can use the pull-out method. Just make sure if you do that, you have to track your fertility. Here you go. Since the day you since, were born, since the day you born, were born, my life has been nothing but a sea of bitterness. I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Mary! Mary!
beautiful. I hear you. Let me help you with that. Sure. Oh my gosh, they can drive me crazy. I'm going crazy. <laughs> I did your baby. When the, last, when the last time you seen his ass? Shit, last night when he was in my ass. No. <laughs> he was in your ass at your house. Though. You ain't never been to that nigga house. Why the fuck you ain't been to his house, man? I don't know. I'm thinking maybe he's like. <sighs> like what? Like in somebody else's ass? Girl, please. You wish he was. No, you wish he was in somebody else's ass. This is the only ass he wants. Oh, okay. If you believe that, it's you crazy. I'm going to go ahead and let you slide in your tears or whatever it is. You know. I think he just he just moved into his place, okay, for one. Uh -huh. Okay, so I'm thinking maybe he need to get some furniture or whatever because he would definitely never not invite me over to his uh -huh. house. Uh -huh. Like you, you sound like you sound like a straight ass hater right now. You did well. Go ahead, say it. Say it. Repeat after me. Big whip. <laughs> no, actually, I am. You sit there wait. I am. I am, and I'm proud of it, honey. Uh huh. Let me he's gonna call me, and he's gonna call me. Okay. I'm praying for you. My condolences. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> Yo, they be bugging. I was just thinking. You are my knight in shining armor. You stupid. You've been taking care of us now for six months and paying the rent. Baby, I don't know what I would do without you. If it wasn't for you, I would be on the streets. Well, you know me. Yeah, I do. And you know me too. Now, let me show you how grateful I am. Oh, you're going snorkeling. Oh, shit. Oh, shit.
Hey, baby. Where the fuck were you? The grocery store. Last time I checked, the fucking grocery store was right up the street. Where the fuck were you? Like I said, the grocery store. I was talking to this lady about becoming a massage therapist. After she noticed my hands, she thought I'd be really great at it, along with my winning personality. You know, they say, if you train up a child in the way that they should go, they will not depart. And I guess that much is true, since you can't seem to keep your hands off of rubbing on strangers. So do you want your chicken fried or baked? You know what? Fuck you, Tony. Make it yourself. Vegan? You tripping. Open your mouth. Nah, babe. Take the sausage. I got the best snack in town. Stop. Yeah, but get some. Come on. Come on now. One bite. Oh, shit. I thought that was your fine ass. Girl, you done filled out like your mama. Shit, hold on, let me fucked up a good cigar here. Mmm, mmm. Nice in all the right places. God damn, baby. Mm, mm, mm. When you ready for some real pipe and some vice in your life, you contact the plumber, baby. I see you about that hot link life. That little sausage. When you want the real, you come holler at the plumber. I got that soul lining. What the fuck? Exactly. What the fuck you got? That catch and release snapper? Every fucking day oh is the same shit. Oh my fucking gosh. Stop being a fucking shit. asshole. You got to get the shit fucking every asshole. fucking day. You know what? I'm going to tell you right now. I've never met a bitch that bitch. I can't live without. <laughs> you know what? You don't need me. You need Jesus. You see, I was raised in the church and I was taught never to fuck around with Jezebel. And what do I end up with? Jezebel's daughter. Who the fuck is Jezebel? <laughs> Who's Jezebel? She was the blueprint of wicked women in the Bible and the cause of the downfall of great men and their kingdoms. So, you saved now? I thought the Bible was supposed to give life. But every time you mention it, it feels like a form of birth control. And all that shit is starting to drive me crazy. Hell, it's just too much work. God. Baby, when we started this, he was like the shot or the injection. Our happiness lasted for months.
But now, you're like that fucking patch. It's thin, and it sticks to your skin. It releases chemicals into your body that controls the organ's function within. Use it on your arm, your back, your stomach, or your ass. It does not matter. The mission is still the same, causing the seeds of life to scatter. And that IUD is a T-shaped device. But in my mind, it might as well be you, the Antichrist, placed inside my uterus to prevent life. And like that pill, I've been taking your shit every day, keeping my eggs at bay. Baby, I can't ovulate. I can't conceive. And with you, I can't rejuvenate. So I can't dream. So, I'm like birth control? All right. Well, I'm gonna use the best method that I know. I'm pulling out. Fuck you, bitch. This ring is rubber, but look, it symbolizes our love. It's strong, it's circular. I mean, you know, we stretch out a shape from time to time, but this ring, it snaps right back. And that's our love. I love you and I need you because you're my earth. Yeah, baby, will you marry me? Yes. Snapper brought you back. I guess they ain't all catch and release. Oh, oh, oh fuck yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 12 pound pussy, Ooh, baby. Yeah, get in that. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, baby. You like oh. that? You like Oh, yeah, Daddy. Mm. Oh, yeah. You mm. miss this? Mm. You miss mm. this? Mm. 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 Oh, oh, give me that 12 pounder, baby. Oh, that 12 pound pussy. Oh, 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 o
baby. What the fuck was that about? What the fuck is going on here? Hold on, hold Who on. Who is that? Let me Who the fuck it. is that? Who the fuck, fuck am I? It's this is my motherfucking house. No, no, it's not what you see. Oh, is that right? Yes, oh, bitch. It's my on. house. Be cool. No, baby, I'm sorry. It's cool. Who the fuck she talking about? Your let's, house? Let me, let, me, let me explain it. Look, look, just. No, I, no. I so that's it. why you don't answer my calls at certain times of the day and night? I'm saying, let me, let me work this out. What the fuck? What the fuck? Oh, shit. Oh, my fucking inconsiderate, dumb piece of shit. Asshole. Fuck you. Just. Oh. Stupid. Stupid motherfucker. Shut up. Let me explain. Look. I was being safe. I used the condom. I, I was being safe, baby. I can't Breathe. Baby, I used I condom. I used the condom. I was being safe. I can't I was breathe. being safe. I can't breathe. And I can't conceive. I can see right through you. Like a condom. That's a thin rubber sheath worn on a man's penis during sex, designed to stop his sperm from entering into my nest. It prevents STDs transmitted through skin to skin touching. And if worn correctly, it stops a man from coming inside me. See? I know my wound is like good ground, waiting to be fertilized. But without a seed to incubate, life cannot arise. I should have known when you rolled up on me to look the other way. But no, that would have been too easy. So I'm going to give you space to collect your own semen. Semen are like condoms. The good ones cover and protect their queens. But obviously, I got a hold of the wrong motherfucker and now my life is like a scene from a goddamn movie where the antagonist controls the mind and the body and the leading lady is left dumb, deaf, and blind. You are a condom over my kingdom. And I gotta get this condom off my head. If I stay with you, I might as well be dead. Now get the fuck out of my house. Get out! This time, I will not return. He's a condom. He's a condom.
Give me an abortion. Mm. Hello? Hi. You okay? Yeah. I like your locks. Nice. Thank you. Yes. My name is Leslie. I'm a lockologist. I work right over here at the barbershop. You should come see me. I'll hook you up. Hook you nice and tight. Okay. Right. I got a business card. Come see me sometime. Thank you. Make sure you come. <laughs> Do you remember me? We met last week at the dollar store next door. Or, well, I decided I needed a tighten up, so I thought I'd check you out. It'd be my pleasure. Have a seat. I'm so glad you came to see me. Giving me a chance to tighten up your locks and an opportunity to play in your hair. I've been waiting on this day. It's always fun with somebody up in the shop. Oh my God. Girl. No, right? Girl. Every day. All the time. It's so annoying. Yeah. And um, thank you for your concern the other day. Can I ask you something silly? Absolutely. How do you feel about black people going to counseling? This is counseling right here. I can't think of a better place than the barbershop to have some great conversations, some good advice, and giving me the chance to run my fingers all through your box. Are you flirting with me? Is it working? Maybe we should move in with each other. What you think? Uh, we we're hoping everything was good. Is there anything else I can get you, ladies? Yeah, bro. The check. The check. Okay. ASAP. The check. I'm sorry about that. That's God's plan for me. He 
just made me realize I'm strictly dick with. So, um, you do you, and I'll do me. Bad. Today is my birthday. Hey, happy birthday. And I hate the day that I was born. Maybe I wasn't supposed to be born at all. I mean, isn't a birthday supposed to be the day of the celebration of life? Yes. And the same day each year, a time of rejoicing? Not a constant reminder of misery and strife. What's up? What's up, baby? Is this real? No. We're pregnant? Oh, yes, Lord. Yes. Johnny. Oh, Jeremy. No. Matthew Jr. Yes, Lord. Oh, my. Yes, Lord. There's no perfect time in now. Please don't hold this against me. I love you, baby. I want you to be with me for the rest of your life. I'm gonna have this family. Okay, okay, we're not gonna do that, you know. Knees bad, baby, but I love you. Will you marry me? Will you marry me? Yes. Oh my God, God you are so good, baby. I wanted to sing happy birthday and, and blow out candles. The simple things in life that I was never blessed to handle. 
So, each year, I try to forget the day that I was born into this world. I was supposed to be my mama's precious baby girl. This day is cursed. I can't bring no baby into this world. Can you imagine what it's like to be unloved, unwanted, and abused your whole life? understand why Mary took her life on my birthday. I was a constant reminder that no matter how hard she tried not to, she still turned into Rebecca. And Mary has been controlling and pimping my life from her grave. And my evil ass grandmother she too mean to die. Shit, the devil in hell don't even want her. Why this day of all days? Your mother this name is, another reason is why Mary. The day that I was born. And her mother name is Rebecca. Hey, whoa, wait. What? You don't want me? No, that's not it at all. I'm just saying, we won't have to have sex every time we get together. You know, I like spending time with you. What, what time is it? What, what time did the street lights come on? Hey! Let go! Anything you say, Kenny. What is she talking about? You in the court of law. What happened? You have a right to an attorney. What is she talking about? I ain't do nothing. I ain't even do nothing. Let me go. Let me go. Let me go. That's him, officer. That's the boy who raped my baby. No, no. She lying. She lying. Get me out of here. Let me go. She had the baby. <sighs> Get my goddamn drink! What the fuck, man? Are you even listening to me? I just sat here and told you my whole life story. Could, could anyone ever love me? You don't understand. So that would make you that crackhead named Joe that raped my mother. Rape? Excuse me? Rape? Is that the lie they told you? Is that the lie that they told you? That I raped your mother? I've never raped anyone in my life. was your evil ass grandmother that put me in prison. What started out as a five year sentence ended up being 14 years of my life. They said I had a knife in my bed. 
Listen, I didn't want to hurt nobody. But do you know what they do to prisoners with rape charges? I had to protect myself. It's going to hurt nobody. 14 years. I wrote letter after letter after letter after letter. To a woman that turned out to be my wife. God truly blessed me. He truly blessed me to get my life back on track. I have my own business. And now I have a daughter. You're my daughter. Renee. Renee. No, 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 Renee, no, no. No, Renee! No! Shit! Same place. This ends with us. Setting up for the night, baby. Just setting up. What's going on? What's going on? Baby, I was just trying to be sexy for you. Trying to be sexy. <laughs> 
I was getting ready for you, baby. What's going on? Baby. Hey. Talk to me. What's going on? What's going on? Say something. Tell me. Let me say something. take Matthew to be your lawfully wedded husband? I do. Matthew, do you take Renee to be your lawfully wedded wife? I do. Good morning, church! Good morning! Listen, 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 church. Today, we are going to talk about uh -huh. what it means to be called by your name. Come on, come on. Come on, come on. Now, 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 some people. Uh huh. Yeah. Come on. That's right. Name their children mm -hmm. ignorantly. Mm -hmm. Without understanding All right. that we are called by our names from birth yeah. until we leave this earth. All right. uh -huh. Uh -huh. Yeah. Now, now, I submit to you today. Uh huh. When we understand the meaning of our names, right, right, right. we shed light on life's challenges so we can see who we were called to be. Come on. Come on. The name Rebecca, I'm going somewhere with this. The name Rebecca means to tie or to bind. Now, Rebecca gave birth to Mary. Yeah. And the name Mary means sea of bitterness. <laughs> but then see, Mary, Mary gave birth to Renee. Uh -huh. And what the devil didn't know uh -huh. is that the name Renee means to be reborn or uh, to be renewed. Right. Come on. Right. So I'm going to tell you a story uh -huh. about a little girl named Renee. Uh -huh. You see, the devil started when she was just a little girl.
to y'all. Is that all right? Hey, man. How you doing? Do. Oh, I'm good, man. I'm good. My, my wife is in there preaching. I'm getting ready to go in. I'm late. That's good. I'm late, man. I had them honeydews, man. Honeydews? Yeah, honeydew list. She had me do all this stuff before church, and oh. she's going to be mad that I'm late. So let me go oh, on and, and get... What, what, oh, hold on, hold on. Come on, come on. Come on, I got her, man. Let's go. Let's go. Get her in, get her in, get her in. Get her in, get her in, get her in. Oh, man. Oh my God! Oh my God! It's hot in here! Oh my God! How, how, how far is the contraptions? I can't get over the thing that I'm caught. Two seconds. Two. Two. Oh, let's go. Baby, you got I'm breathing. I'm breathing. I'm breathing. I'm breathing. Oh, come on, baby. Baby, breathe. I'm breathing. Breathe. Not you, her. Breathe. Come on. Move out the way! Oh, I'm sweating like Gail King at a Cody Bryan Memorial. Oh. I was on the verge of a breakdown, but it's time for me to emerge from the shallow ground. I remember being thirsty. I felt unworthy. But after all that I've been through, my God is saying, it's time for me to get you to walking in favor. Okay, we're almost there. One more push, okay? One more. All right. And push. Time to 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 take action. Time to push. I can see everything on the track. Nia means purpose in Swahili. 